Who's mm, what is going on, everybody? It is me, the Fade and Fire, and today, all right, well, I got you guys right. Today, I am finally gonna teach you guys how to mod your Eliza, right? You guys have been asking me like crazy, but first things first, you guys owe me for this, right? You guys owe me big time because I downloaded a whole bunch of stuff trying to figure it out. A whole bunch of stuff that I probably shouldn't have, and now I probably have some like weird hentai virus on my computer, right? You all be big time. You all be big time, right? Before we get into the video, did you guys watch the E League? Oh my god, dude, E League was sick, right? E League was sick, man. E League was so sick, man. Jimmy, Jimmy is a right. He's God, right? There was no doubt that he's the best American player, right? But what he did was sick, right? Nine, nine people straight too good right and i know people are giving him a lot of shit about uh saying that his team sucks even though i think cuddlecore was really right really going crazy cuddlecore was doing good it's just i think you guys are taking it to heart too much right i feel like i know a lot of people like jimmy right? i don't know jimmy personally but i feel like i know you know the kind of person he is and he's the kind of person that like doesn't give a shit if you don't have results right in the fighting business it's it's a lot like that right it's a lot of people like that right so they don't necessarily like look down on you they just don't give a shit if you don't show any results like if you don't have any medals if you ain't got this right they yeah they don't care right but i don't think he was saying like they're trash he's just saying that the odds were against them which they were and you know he it worked out it was crazy right it was crazy but anyway off topic right so the first thing you're going to need to do to modulize is open up all your uh, files and stuff like that, right? Uh, go to local disk. I don't know where yours is going to be, right? But mine is in program files times 86. And you're going to need to find Steam. All right, where the hell is Steam? Steam is right here. All right, after you find Steam, you're going to need to go to uh, Steam apps, right? And you're going to go to Steam. And then you're going to go to Steam apps, right? So mine, like I said, I think everybody's is in profile uh, program files times 86, right? So after you go to program files 86 you're going to need to go to steam and you need to go to, uh, to steam apps right after you go to steam apps you're going to need to go to common i think everybody's called common right common all right after you go to common you're going to look at the games that you have and you're going to open up tekken 7 am i going too fast i feel like i'm talking hella fast right so after you go to steam apps you're going to go to common all right and then you're going to go to tekken 7 right in tekken 7 you're going to uh select tekken game and then you're going to go to content and then you're going to go to packs, right? This thing called packs, right? So after you go to Tekken 7, you're going to go to Tekken game, content, and then you're going to go to packs, right? Now, in packs, you're going to create a new folder, right? You're going to create a new folder called squiggly line packs, right? That, I don't know. What the, look, man, I'm not a fucking English teacher. I don't know what the hell that thing is called, right? But squiggly line packs, right? So create a new folder called squiggly line packs, even though I already created one. Uh, hello? All right. New folder. All right. And you're going to call it squiggly. Wait, where the hell is my squiggly line? I don't even know where the hell it is on my. Oh, it's here. All right. Squiggly line mods, right? All right. So once you do that, fucking. No, I don't want to do fold it, right? So after you do that, right? Uh, right, so after you do that, you're going to then look for the mod that you want, right? So I know you guys are going to search your shit up yourselves. So I'll put a whole bunch of links in the freaking description, all right? I'll put a whole bunch of links, right? So the, the, uh, so the mods that I got, some of my mods from, like this one and a whole bunch of other stuff, is from this guy's YouTube channel, right? This guy's YouTube channel. I'll link his YouTube channel in the description. I'll link the... Dude, you guys want me to link fucking everything, huh? All right. <laughs> I'll link everything, all right? So I'm going to link uh, his YouTube channel. And then I think the wings I got from here and then the the Jayu and the Nina top I got from here. I'm pretty sure, right? Whatever. I'll link it, you lazy bastards, right? And then I got the uh, Devil Eliza from this thing, right? I'll also link this so you won't even have to worry about it, right? So once you download, so say I want to download Jensu, right? I don't give a shit about Jen. I'm just using an example. All right, I'm going to download it. Bam, download. And then it's going to show up as uh, a pack, right? It's going to show up as a pack, all right? And you're going to want to drag that pack to your desktop, right? Like this, 
right? It's going to be in your desktop, right? And then once you drag it to your desktop, you're going to want to open up that folder that you had here, right? And you're going to want to put it in this mod section, right? So uh, let's open up Tekken. Let's open up Tekken. But yeah, it was sick, man. It was sick. Oh God, how am I gonna do this? It's gonna be awkward. All right, Tekken isn't, but man, it was sick, y'all. Y'all have to watch it, right? Y'all have to support stuff like that. Y'all have to support stuff like that. Uh, you know, uh, like tournaments and all that good stuff, right? You have to support things like that, you know? Uh, you're gonna see my face for a bit because I'm gonna like switch this thing to my other desktop. So excuse me, excuse me. Oops, wrong. All right, but it was sick. It was sick. So there's a couple things that you have to understand about the mods, right? The way they use the mods is they override one of the one of the clothes that you have, right? So in this devil Eliza, right, it makes her like green, <laughs> right? It'll it'll always have her green no matter what what skin you pick or anything that you pick, right? So but the only thing you have to do is then drag it out of this folder, right? And then just put it back in whenever you want to use it, right? I'm the kind of guy that only uses one skin anyway. All right, so if I go to practice mode and then I pick my Devil Eliza outfit. All right, and this is what I mean by override, right? So the Devil Eliza outfit, I think, is over the maid, the maid deal, right? So this costume right here. So once you go into practice mode and you drag this uh, mod into the folder, it's going to override the the clothes in the customization thing. And you'll see what I mean in a minute. Once this thing loads up, once this thing uh, loads up. All right. So, right, this is the thing I have here, right? And it's not Devil Eliza. Well, because I don't have the mod in there, right? So now that we see, right, this outfit right here, it overrides this outfit. So once you drag this mod into the folder, you will no longer be able to use this outfit unless you drag it back out, right? So now that we see that, close that out. And then, uh, let me just bring everything over here, right? And then I'm gonna take my Devil Eliza pack and then I'm gonna put it into my squiggly line mods folder. All right, and then once I do that, I'm going to rerun Tekken. And that thing was serious, man. It was serious. Tekken is so good. And they're having another, they're having another world tour. Man. Another world tour, let's go. I'm excited. I'm excited to say the least, right? To say the least. I'm excited to say the least. All right, so now that we dragged our squiggly, our, our mod pack into the squiggly line mod thingy, we are then going to go practice mode or whatever, you know, you don't have to, but I'm just gonna show you that that's what you have to do, right? And then you're gonna pick the costume that you have, right? So it'll override a certain thing, right? Some of them, if you install the wings, I think it overrides like the, uh, the little bands you, they, their little red bands that you put over the head, right? Once you search, you'll see it, right? It's not that hard to find out. And then now I have my devil Eliza, all right? So that's how you mod people, all right? Uh, that's, that's basically it, right? Not that hard, not that difficult, even though if you don't have the information, it can be very difficult, right? Uh, took me about a day to figure out, honestly. <laughs> right, wasn't that difficult. But that is gonna be it for this video, you guys, right? So uh, I'll link all this shit, because I already know everybody's gonna want me to link it, because you guys just, right? You guys don't wanna search shit for yourself, right? You don't wanna do that, right? So just follow the steps that I had. If I went too fast, just rewind it, right? But overall, it's pretty easy. And of course, if you want to use the outfit that you had on that, say if you use the pants or the, or if you don't want your Eliza to be green anymore, all you have to do is then open up your squiggly line mods folder 
and then drag it back out and then it'll go back to normal again All right but that is going to be it for this video you guys i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you guys enjoyed the mods because you know your boy does i use them all the time <laughs> but that's gonna be it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoy it uh, go ahead, show your boy some love, like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you support Tekken World Tour, man. Watch. Just watching and supporting, right? But I'm out.